Direct out of Philadelphia, PA, a Brazilian jiu-jitsu who has uh, earned a lot of respect. Style, all kinds of crazy stuff, but also guys at Daniel Gracie's and Coach John at EEFC, long time. A lot of guys don't want to fight Jeremiah when he decides to be creative, and I hope that... Speaks to how well-rounded Jeremiah Wells is. Teen here in Las Vegas, Warley Alves says, but he says he looks good and he feels his better. There weren't many fans in there, but you can hear how excited they were. He feels good just in his life all around. I mean, when we form to what the expectation has been, maybe, right, because he's beat guys that have held. Normally, I see Warley Alves, he's a little bit bitter, a little bit after the kick. Amazing. Is up next till the tape. Marley Alves, Jeremiah Well has a two inch edge in reach. Back in we are set to go with the next fight tonight. Three rounds. This in the UFC welterweight division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner. He's a striker with a background in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. At five feet nine inches tall, he weighed an officially 171 pounds in 11 professional fights. His record stands at eight victories. Two defeats with one draw, fighting out of Philadelphia, PA. Here is Jeremiah Wells. And across the octagon, his opponent fighting out of the red corner. He's a kickboxer sitting five feet, 11 inches tall. He too weighed in officially 171 pounds and in 19 professional fights, holds a record of 15 victories. With four defeats, introducing the ultimate fighter, Brazil three middleweight winner from Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Here is Wally Alves. And your referee in charge of the action is Chris Donioni. Ready for this next matchup at welterweight. Brooklyn with us here in Las Vegas. Warley Alves, a minus 240 favorite here in this one. Jeremiah Wells, UFC debut, taking it on short notice, but he's got a couple of regional belts on the East Coast, CES, CFFC. Ready? And a uh, training partner of one Paul Felder in the past. So we'll see what he has for Warley Alves here in the octagon. Oh, oh my goodness. You said he was explosive, Paul. I told you. No joke. He's got to watch here. He's got to settle in here. A lot of that was a little bit of a slip there from Warley Alves, but Jeremiah ends up on top. You see Wells trying to feed his arm to the, to the opposite side. He's trying to grab Warley's arm from behind him with his left arm. Right here, look at that. Look at him feed it. You see, he's trying to feed it over to the arm. So if Warley goes to his side, he's going to be in a lot of trouble. Yeah, and Jeremiah's very good at this. He's done this to me several times. He's physically strong. If they get back on their feet, you can pick, he will pick people up over his head and slam them down. Very exciting fighter to watch. Keep but the toes out of the cage, please. Oh, he's got his a veteran right now, so he's just going to bide his time. He's got to get that man. arm back. This dude is strong. I tell you. Look at that. I mean, he's literally holding his hand with his, with his, grabbing his wrist with his hand on the opposite side. Oh, and now oh, big stuck. punches here from, from Jeremiah Wells. And now Warley's stuck, right, with no post arm. He's completely taking the post arm away. Yeah, he's holding on to that right arm. Oh, he got it. Now he got it clear. Warley got it clear. <laughs> Eats a few big punches, though. I mean, this is how you want to start if you're Jeremiah Wells. <laughs> <laughs> nice elbows here as well. He was pinned up in the corner of the octagon there as well. He backs off. We'll see what the game plan is here. Oh, that hurt. Oh, oh. big left hand there from Jeremiah. Let him up to the one, two. My only concern with Jeremiah is at this fighting at this type of pace with this much explosiveness, the gas tank. And Morley Alves also has that issue, but at least yeah. he's been in these types of battles in the octagon before. Well, if you're Jeremiah Wells, you know, all that explosiveness comes, with, comes at a cost, right? You don't get it all for free. You don't get the ability to go from zero to 100 for right. 15 minutes, right? You got to use it in spurts. Wells got to be very careful. Warley has a really good guillotine. Yes. So as he starts to lower his level, he's got to be careful not to allow Warley to jump on his neck. Holds a finish over Kobe Covington, yeah? Yeah, yeah he did. Guillotine him right away, very early in the fight. 
Yeah, at that point, Alves improved to 10-0 with a win over Colby Covington. Looks pretty good on the resume. His strength of schedule is there. He's also fought Kamaru Usman. And you mentioned it, Paul, where a lot of people were in break. Normally during a fight week, Wiley Alves might be feeling it, the weight cut, whatever. He looked good this week. He was smiling. He was ready to go. Yeah, he did. He, you know, he was, he was as calm as I've ever seen him. Oh. I mean, but Wells is just exploding into everything. His, on his face, right? He looks calm. But, I mean, every punch is thrown to knock Wally Alves out. I mean, people wonder why Felder was so tough. He's training with Jeremiah Wells every day. Jeremiah's trying to take his head off with every single strike. Yeah, they weren't sparring oh. matches so much as fights. You know what I mean? I mean, look at that. But now he's got to be careful, right? Because Warley's kind of gotten his timing a little bit. He's making him miss big, and he's making him pay after he misses on his big combinations. But I'm already seeing improvements uh, from Jeremiah. Normally, you know, he gets a bit wild and reckless with the feet, but even though this is, believe me, this is actually him toned down and being a little more calculated. Really? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Don't grab the cage. Because he seems Jeremiah like he's, he's very aggressive, right? And unorthodox. Put, and hard to seem, figure out. He seems to be putting a lot into everything. I wonder if he's going to be able to sustain this. That's, that's the backlash, right? Is He can get you out of there. He can hurt you and and he's been training really hard for this he's known that he's been on that short list of getting that call for a long yeah. time now i think he's even gotten the call where it didn't pan out so he's known to stay in the gym and be ready for a fight so this is where he's got to be very careful yeah he was with warley alves Baeza. look at that look 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 you see it i believe he there it is yeah this is this gotta is be careful here be, yes, look look guillotine Warley will jump in. Uh, oh, yep, there it problem. is. You got to be got careful. With Warley Alvarez is tight. He's out. Nice work there from Jeremiah. But again, he's on his back now. And Warley Alvarez has only got 15 seconds, but maybe getting a bit more confidence in knowing where he wants to take this fight in round two. Out for the uptick as Alves returned to his feet. Final seconds of round one. Take away. Back after this. Whoa! Oh. Bring the soup, bring the soup. Yeah. It's there? I thought it was here. It was sitting there. Let's go. Sit here. Now, perfect round, okay? Perfect round. Now. Now you're warm, now you're ready. I don't want you desperate, okay? You're getting a little desperate, you're getting tired because of that. I want you to set up your combinations. Okay, don't just go. I want to see you pumping that jab, pump that jab. Watch your breathing, watch your breathing. This round, we just, you only got even at the end. Just don't get close. He, he's, he's getting tired, you know, so he's, that fresh is over. The trilogy will be settled in Las Vegas. Plus. No time to waste. Jeremiah Wells quick to get back to work. Lands a nice jab there. You heard the Wells corner tell him now. You don't need to just calm down. You're getting tired because you're being a bit desperate. Oh, oh. oh catches him. him and wobbles him with the right that time. When Wells explodes, though, his hands are kind of low and his chin is up in the air. He's got to be very careful looking out for a counter shot. Oh, oh. oh. down. Oh, 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 Jeremiah Wells. Enter the big show! Ah!